Well, they are with the young sports. Oh, and a couple of donkeys. <laughs> uh, one of my uh, landowners has called us in. He's getting a problem with the uh, another chicken thief in Charlie. Um, you recognise this place? So I took five off of here in two outings. Uh, uh, what we're thinking is uh, the town court fox is being dumped off. As you just get more and more and more foxes all the time. So, um, as Jake's proudly po uh, posing, we're going to have the, uh, the field master out in a minute and the uh, Icotec 300 call, aren't we? Which, uh, David, if you open that door and reach over the top, you can get the uh, 300 out for me. We're going to get that set up in a minute. Just there, up over the top, you'll see it in a red box. You can't miss it. Anyway, Jake, what do you reckon to the Nightmaster there? Brilliant. Brilliant, eh? It's pretty good. And, uh, well, I, I still haven't got used to using it on a rifle. Um, I actually, in fact, think it's a really good unit for a short to medium range. And I think it's going to be really exceptional on uh, rabbits and uh, foxes out to 100 yards. I, you've got good clear eye shine at 300 yards and clear visibility at 200 yards, but you can't really uh, make out... Um, the exact shape and I like to be 101% positive of what I'm looking at but inside 100 yards it's very clear uh, so and you can pick the thing yeah that's the one so you got the architect 300 GC 300 there now you you guys what was the one you liked the last time you guys came out it was the uh, architect 101 wasn't it as you can hear we got airplanes going up because we're right next to the airport and uh, so uh, don't shake it around you bust it and uh, so, uh, well, who's going to be in charge of the remote control then on this one? Are you sure? Well, I'll have to see. So you're going to, so you do, you guys can help do the call, and then Jake's going to be uh, watching on the night vision spotter that I've made up. Because what have I made as a handle for it? Because it's, it's dedicated for a rifle, really, isn't it? Yeah, I've used a walking stick to make a handle. And now I know that uh, Nightmaster of. Uh, people from Pitch Black Nightmaster Nick there they have made a handle with a tripod version so you can stand it on your bonnet which I think this thing is really going to be make a good spotter hello mate you coming to say hello anyway so with any luck we'll get a fox in a minute yeah mate well hopefully they won't do anything with it but we'll find out shortly when we switch it on hey you pair want to join in as well you two can reassure he's a fox if we get one Anyway, he thinks you've got food in there, so... Anyway. <laughs> we, we better rock and roll then, all right? So, uh, what'd you say? What'd you say? Uh, proper job, Maka. Maka! Hello, donkey! Well, here we are. I don't know if you can see me moving around. But, uh... There the boys are using the, uh... Fieldmaster. That's a spider mind. Light sights all set up, ready to go. She's got to pop a bullet in when I'm ready. And take the fox, hopefully. Right, there we go, we'll leave the boys uh, spotting. There we go. Well, it's getting on a bit now, lads. Your mum's already texted me, says she's uh, they finished uh, Slimmer World, so I've got to take you back. So, uh, how do you like the uh, new uh, pitch black unit? And I've used it as a handheld, so you guys can see. Yeah, yeah. Do you want a good bit of kit? Are you enjoying it? Yeah. And, uh, well, you've got your Icotec out on, haven't you, uh, or, or Jake? Yeah. Yeah. So the Icotec, you can hear the Icotec. I don't know if you guys can hear it on camera. But I've got the, the Jack Rabbit out there calling away. That seems to be the favourite at the moment. And uh, young David there. You, you enjoying this, David? Yeah. What about you, uh, Ty? Yeah. Yeah, right. Anything oh, about... Oh. What? Fox coming in, coming in. Where to? Coming in, let me see, let me see, let me see. Let me see, hang on. Go away, go, hold, hold the camera, Ty, hold the camera. Let me switch the lights on. Where is he coming? Where is he coming? Yeah, no, but it's hard to
Yes, get down. You see that? Yes. Yeah. You got I'll him. Wait. You got him. You got him on camera as well. Have I got him on camera? Yeah. Oh, bad. The old ice creeper never fails. Young shots as the spiders. Oh, yes. Let's go and get him. <laughs> yeah. You're going to use the night sight and find him? Or are you going to use the uh, pitch black? You're going to use the pitch black. Yeah. We'll make your rifle safe. Who wants the cartridge? Me. Okay, David. There you go. David. Oh, there you go. Thank you. Right, let's go. Thanks. Well, lads, I'm going to be uh, showing around you. What do you think of that, then, boys? Proper <laughs> Let's go fight this fox. Right, he's out here somewhere, boys. He was right near the corner. The corner is by that little bush. He was about six foot away when I stood, when I should fired. We got him. Yeah, turn the corner off. We don't need that anymore. Did we get the fox? Yeah. Oh wow, man. Hey, guy. Hey, lads. What do you reckon? Oh, I haven't shot him in the ear, I shot him right in the front of his uh, face. Right, right under his chin it went. Yeah. Right, so, now he's dead alright. That was a good headshot. <laughs> I barked at him and he, uh, let's have a look, turn him over, let's have a look. Turn him over. Well, there you go, that's, that's the exit wound, boys. Yeah. Hey, 58 grain Norma does the job. What do you reckon? Yeah. Well, there you go, lads. Go on then, who's going to retrieve him? What, Jake, can you get the caller? Yep. Well, how about that? About six foot away from the caller. I had a bark to stop him in. So what do we say about the Ica Tech? What do you reckon? Job. Proper job? Yep. Hey, when you get a bit older, are you going to do the shooting? Yep. That's right, I'll do the filming. You can do the shooting, my young sports. Hey, and what do you two reckon? Hey, look at that. My two top retrievers. Hey, what we got? A nice dog fox? He looked like a dog. Is it a dog fox? Yeah. Yeah? I think he's dead. Well, on that note, let's go and take that chicken thieving Charlie down to the farmer because he'll be happy we got him. He had his two prize geese the other night. Did he? Yep, his two favourite geese. So uh, I think he's happy. Well, what do we say then, lads? Proper job, Marker. <laughs>